guys we're here at the, the lot not sure what's going on here but apparently we've decided to park right in front of the sign for both of these Kentucky I'm gonna guess they're together pick and choose which one you want to take because I guarantee they're both together anyway let's see what we have all-wheel drive or all-wheel drive all-wheel drive but we'll scoop one up all right guys number three that's going to yell at me Everything auto. Hey, yes, I just have a question. Do y'all do anything about people blocking public roadways? Uh, if it's a public roadway, you'll have to get uh, with the police department. Um, if it's blocking a, a, a city street or a, a county road, uh, it'll have to be, yeah, it had to be the police department. Okay, because I just wonder, because there's like five cars and they're just blocking everything up, so. Yeah, yeah, if it's out in the county, just give the county a call and let them know and they'll send a tow truck. Oh, yeah, I, yeah, I didn't know because it's right here behind the old mill. So would I just do the same thing in that like small residential neighborhood? It's yeah. like right here in front of a couple of houses and it's a one way street. Yeah, yeah, that'd be, um, yeah, call the, the city, the city of Pigeon Forge. Okay. All right, thank you, man. Appreciate it. Oh. Everything auto? Yeah, hey, uh, I was parked in downtown Gatlinburg. I think you guys might have towed my car it's a black ford explorer uh yeah in the um, the employee parking lot yes sir i okay yeah Where, where's how do i get to you uh 221 newman road is the uh, pickup address 221 newman yes sir newman hold on put that in your phone 221 newman how do you know how far it is from that lot uh, i mean it's it's a few miles down the road there okay how do you spell newman how, newman is <laughs> N E W M A N? Yes, yes, correct. It's a seven-minute. And you're sure you got it there, right? One point eight miles. Yes, black in color, yes. Ford Explorer. Yes. You got yeah. There's no way for you guys to come pick us up, right? We need to take a walk or take an Uber. Or? Yeah, you'd have to get probably a cab ride down here. As long as you're, the, you have to be the registered owner as well. ID matches registration for the release. Um, yeah. Yeah. The, the the cost too is it has to be cash to that registered owner only. Cash? That's yeah, we don't have any any way of running cards for the illegal parks. Where does it? It doesn't say anything about dollars. Where? Well, where does it say that? What do you mean? Where does it say that? Yeah, like it doesn't talk anything about a fine. Like it can just—it's just an arbitrary number. But like, what if it was? What if you told me it was ten thousand? You know what I mean? No, I guess I don't. I don't. I don't follow you. I don't know where you see that there's that there's something. <laughs> No, 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 I'm just saying, shouldn't it, like, say around here, like, what the the tow cost is, instead of, like, never, never mind. No, it just, it just, it says, uh, private, pro uh, private property, uh, employee parking only, um, and you private guys were... property, employee parking, uh, no parking violation. There's a rickety sign here. Okay, 221 Newman? 221 Newman, yep. Okay, bye. Okay. I'm not sure what, uh, I was having a hard time following that one. Um, I guess he was looking for, uh, shouldn't it be, or shouldn't it, I, I don't even know. <laughs> the price is, uh, is the price, so we'll see what he says when he gets here. It doesn't say anything about a fine. Shouldn't it be free? Everything auto. Yeah, I might need to see about getting my car back that you towed. Mm, what kind of car you got? And black Nissan Altima. Yes, ma'am. Um, yeah. Towed into 221 Newman Road? I have no idea. I parked there. I went to go drop my son, walked my son to the Anna Kista, and I came back and it was gone. Yes, ma'am. That, uh, they called for employee parking only right there where your car was towed away. Okay. Um, but as long as you're the registered owner, ID matches registration, we can release the vehicle back to you. Uh, the cost associated is has to be cashed to that registered owner. Are you serious? It's dollars. 
Uh, yes, ma'am. Are you kidding me? Hey, it's dollars if y'all want to get your car back. Hold on one second. You said cash or card? No, I had cash only. Cash only? How am I supposed to get cash? Um, there's some ATMs around the area. But I don't have dollars in, in off of an ATM. I'll have to get a card from a, my parents. Okay. Uh, I'm sorry. That's just our policy for the illegal parks. My God. I guess she's uh, hanging up on me after that, huh? And it sounded like the third people involved in the candy kitchen were there as well and she was relaying them the price you know I, that's kind of a bad deal i'd hate to think that you'd have to call your parents for uh, uh money because you messed up and parked where you shouldn't have but anyway keep in mind too this lady said she parked there to take her son to anakista and when she came back her car was gone and this is just absurd to her that she should have to uh pay to get her car back but anakista has a gigantic parking lot. Um, I've showed you guys in a video, it's paid. When you go to Anakista, you pay Anakista to park your vehicle and you do all of Anakista's wonderful things to do. But she's decided that she didn't want to pay for parking. That's where we're at right now. Everything auto. Uh, yes, I believe you have towed my car. What kind of car you got? 2021 red and black Toyota Camry. Yes, ma'am, employee parking lot. Uh, they called for the removal. Uh, okay, well, I don't know where you are or how to get there. What's it going to cost me to get it from you? Um, as long as you're the registered owner, ID matches the registration of that vehicle, I can release it back to that owner. The cost associated is has to be cash. Has to be cash. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Um, all right. Um, I mean, I'm the registered owner, so, I mean, so okay. my name is on it. Okay. Um but I just have credit cards, so um, I don't know where I go to. There's ATMs. Huh? There's ATMs in and around. Actually, right across from that lot where you guys were parked at, there's a bank that's got an ATM. Okay. All right. All right. So, well, um, yeah, we'll do that. Thank you. Uh, thank oh, you. Where are you located? Wait a minute. I don't even know where you're located. Uh, 221 Newman Road. How far is that from where you told me? Um, It's a few miles down the parkway there. You'd probably have to get a cab or an Uber or Lyft, something like that. Okay, and it's everything auto, cash, my ID, and we're good. Yes, ma'am. Okay. All right, thanks. Uh, thank you. That was the nicest of the three. <laughs> everything auto. Hey, um, what's your address? We're going to, I guess we got to take an Uber to you now? Uh, yes, ma'am. 221 Newman Road, Gatlinburg. 221 Newman Road. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Thanks. Bye. Thank you. Bye. I guess it's go time. Here for my car, Brad Tom, Black Explorer. Black Explorer. If you got keys and ID that matches registration, I'll. Okay, I'll bring it up here to you. You got something. Show you the ID. Yeah, sure. Thank you, sir. What is it? That receipt. Thank you. Oh, there's those keys. Have a good one. You too, man. Okay, uh, one down, two to go. We, we picked up three pretty much at the same time. I don't know what the deal was. Everybody decided they were going to park in uh, the employee parking lot all at the same time. And I was giggling earlier. I said, well, I guess they could have just took one cab. They could have shared a cab and got all three of them here. But it looked like they walked, which is uh, it's quite the hike from... Uh, the uh, parking lot over there. Anyway, got a couple more coming. Yes, sir. I believe so. Yeah. What? Which one was yours? The 2021 black and red Toyota Camry. Stop it! Shut your mouth. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Okay. So, what do you need from me? I know you need cash. Yeah, as long as the ID matches registration. Sorry, sir. It's her car. You need the cash too? Uh, yes, yes, ma'am. I mean, I, you, we, whenever I just get your car up here for you real quick and. Uh, is it a light camera? Oh, yeah. Thank you. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. Thank you. ID, here we go. Yes, ma'am. Is that back? 
And you've got keys so I can? Yes. It cost me a lot of money. Mm. So I don't know why y'all want to charge That's me more money. That's the fob that goes in it. Okay, this is the fob. Okay. Bring it and bring it up, I guess, whatever. Okay. Um, yeah, well, uh, you're welcome. <laughs> yeah, it's a very nice car. Thank you. <laughs> We've got one severely drunk. So, hopefully this goes well. She's trying her best to keep him quiet. Oh, well, there's the rest of the beard in the back. Thank you, sir. See, it even has my name on the front. Well, yeah, yeah. No, it's a, yeah, it's a very nice car. Thanks. They just got you in the wrong parking spot, I guess. Yeah, I didn't know that it was, uh, there was no parking sign, but it was pushed over. Okay. Yeah, that parking lot is... Notorious for this, right? Yeah, it happens. It happens a lot over there. Ah, yeah. Anakista's right across the street and all kinds oh, of stuff. Yeah. It's It gets it gets pretty crazy, but... <laughs> well, be careful. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that looks great. <laughs> I don't even drink. <laughs> There's quite a bit in there, so we oh were. <laughs> That's him. <laughs> you know? you oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> hey, I'm sorry. Hey, uh, I want you to look in my bag for I'm Look how great. <laughs> <laughs> you working in oh, come on, you <laughs> Yes. You yes, we like do. You want to whoop your ass. No, no. Here. You, you got lighter. You got you just got to be careful. You got lighter. Come on, I'm going to I don't. I'm sorry. I do. In the car. Do I have a car? Yeah, there's probably <laughs> Damn, is their car. It's a nice one, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> You're drinking a lot of beer tonight. Uh, that was yesterday. Yesterday. Okay. Well, you got started early then, huh? Look at all that. I don't see what's in the back of my floorboard. Oh no, I've seen it. Okay. <laughs> That's so good. <laughs> they say you need to quit. Yeah. yeah. Like well. AA batteries. Hey, as long as you're not driving, that's the important part. No. You I'm got driving. you got this this young lady right here to, to show for you around. <laughs> Please get in the car. Be careful. These roads are crazy. Yes. You're amazing. Thank you. You're you're very welcome. Maybe not amazing for taking my I know. <laughs> Thank you guys. You're very welcome. <laughs> okay, guys, that was a tremendous amount of beer. One sober lady to drive him around, so hopefully he doesn't give her too much hassle because he was completely smashed. And there was a, uh, a whole 24 pack still in the back seat. So he's got plenty to keep the party started. I just hope that she can keep him under control. Anyway, I uh, got one more on the way. Well, I guess um, maybe now I'm not getting an answer. It's the last of the pickups and um, whew, it's getting a little late. Hello. Hey, this is Jeff, Everything Auto. I missed your call. Uh, yes, I was just calling to let you know that uh, we're going to be there within an hour. Y'all have my Nissan Altima. Y'all just got it from over here at the CMB Bank parking lot across from Ananista. Uh, oh, yes, sir. Yeah, um, boy, if you guys are you guys are coming soon because it's uh, we're we're at the 11 o'clock hour now and how, how, how quick are you guys thinking uh, it's to get an uber it's hard for us to get an uber that's what we're waiting on is the uber to get here okay what i you, you might try ben's taxi ben's uh is usually pretty quick in the area okay all right i appreciate it thank, uh, you. thank you everything auto hey this is again how you doing hey buddy doing um, good give us you give us till 11 30 because we'll be there until at 11 30 at no later. if we're not there by 11 30 yeah. okay all right i'll uh, i'll have somebody waiting all right thank all right, you thank you bye-bye all right guys you heard that one 11 30. Hello. 
Black Nissan Ultima. Black Nissan. Yep. If you got keys, I'll bring it up here for you. Uh, all right. Give me just a sec. And you got ID that matches. That's her in the right there in the passenger seat. Okay. Hey. Yeah, I got her ID actually. Okay. Yeah. If I just take a peek, make sure I'm giving the car back to the thank you to the right person. I trust you. I'm a diesel technician. Can I mind if you mind if I walk around the car real quick? Oh no no. Go right ahead. Go right ahead. I'm a diesel test, so I know what the flight's like. Yeah, no, no. Do you need a light? Okay. I appreciate it. And no, man, they just call me to remove cars. Um, if the, the Anakista lot had a paid parking lot that was dollars for a five mile drive, come on, dude. Unattended tow, no Go. keys. Go. Got to pay to park. You heard that one. I like how they want to blame me. That's typical. I like it though. All right, let's go see if we can uh, get into some more trouble. And it's always kind of the same. I, I feel like I want to touch on that too. They want to say that uh, I can't believe it's it's that much money for a, a five mile tow and um, I always try to explain it to them but they're not they're not wanting to hear it they're they're just wanting to yell and scream at me and, and pretend like I'm I've done something wrong but it's it's not about the, the distance on that guys and I've tried to explain it it's it's an unattended tow so I don't have any keys the parking brakes usually said it's in a horrible parking lot that we try to get out of and uh, on top of that you know we go through uh, the meeting process and um, we have to call them in and have to run the plates and you know just the special equipment that it, that it takes but you guys know this you guys watch the channel you know what it's all about but they always want to act like uh, it should be free like the first guy I can't believe there's a fee there's a fee associated with this okay guys we are here at the moonshine mountain coaster we got a late night tow it's about midnight um, playing catch up here if you guys have not done the super cool roller coaster it takes off from uh, 321 in the parking lot here and um, and zooms up the mountainside. But it's a busy night here in downtown Gatlinburg and we're gonna see if we can get this scooped up. What I'm gonna do is I'll walk around because it's an unattended tow and and well, I just like to cover my hind end when it comes to, uh, we got some tape down there on that bumper. So hopefully they know I didn't tape it. Got a, looks like quite a bit of scratches. Bumper has some some stuff here but uh yeah it's parked here and we're going to get it towed over to the repair shop i'm not sure what's wrong with it we're going to get it out of here okay guys welcome back to the channel we have uh made our way up to zurich court and got a pd call in for someone stuck got an officer waiting for us at the end of a he says it turns into gravel so we're going to see if we can uh, locate these people hopefully we can see lights before we get there you guys know uh, Zurich Court is pretty intense. We've got Copen here today is the pilot. I am being co-pilot and we're going to see if we can rescue this lady off of... Uh, looks like the bear's been into that, huh? For sure. There's trash everywhere. It seems like I've been up here several times. I think it makes a loop on this gravel road somehow. Almost positive it makes some crazy ass lights. I don't know whether we're gonna to have to back down it or pull down it or what's gonna happen with the down it. If uh if I can get yeah, I'll we'll just stop right here. I'll get out. Let's get out and see what's going on. Hello officer! So it's kind of in a weird position. It's, it's like a weird position. It, it, it's a <laughs> I have been up here several times. It's usually they've gone a little bit further up. Yeah, and she can't get it turned around. She's uh, terrified of backing it out. Anybody go for a swim today? That's, yeah, I'm gonna start. The, the last folks I got were up here around this, because it goes all the way through, right? To the top, I'm pretty sure. No. It better not. It does, but it's intense. It's, it's rough. It's very intense, yeah. I, I got somebody that was way up there by that top of that tree there. there. It was crazy. There was an Uber driver, the last one that was up there. 
Oh my goodness, you got like a tire hanging. Yeah. So we don't think it'll... You can try, I couldn't get it. We don't think it'll go? You're welcome to try. It doesn't seem bad. It doesn't seem horrible. We got like traction control on and all that good stuff. Um, maybe. Maybe I put it in low and that still didn't work. Uh, Hi guys, how are you? Scared. 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 Uh, we have emergency brakes. We don't have emergency brakes on. Yeah, or? it's on, but please tell me to put it on. I didn't even pop my hood. I probably just popped the hood. It's all the same, but it's okay. We'll leave it up for now. Well, hopefully I won't be doing those speeds. I don't know. <laughs> you want to back it out, do you? Well, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Bushes. I'm gonna pull in here behind you, I guess, so I can turn around. Do you think you can get turned around? Uh, yeah, probably. And then we'll. Or he can drive. I'm just, I'm done. We'll just, we'll follow the officer up and. Uh, yeah. I'll pay you. Let's um, do that. Do you have room in here yeah. for? Okay. Yeah. We'll, uh, we'll get there. For There's a piece. driveway right down there on the left. Okay. Okay, guys. So now we are. It's me here in the truck by myself, and I'm. Uh, following them up here this this poor lady she is scared to death she had one wheel hanging off and she was stuck in the ditch so Jeff is in there now helping her out driving her the rest of the way to her cabin and I'm following her back up and um yeah thank you Gatlinburg police for showing us where it's at we appreciate you yay we made it okay guys um we got them safe to their cabin they're unloading their uh, luggage right now so we were able to drive her up here she was just in no state of mind to drive after that so we were able to get to get her up here to her spot they're going to continue their vacation but it's kind of a tough spot here you know you can get freaked out especially at night but i think during the day once uh, we get some daylight going on they will be better as far as navigating this road so we got coven here coven's taking over for old dad he's um backing up he's backing up uh this, oh, it's crazy. Uh, I don't know if I can even navigate this. I'm just gonna get the window down. He's backing up, backing up this little one lane mountain road with lots of kudzu and trees. But he's doing a fantastic job, so I'm going to uh, cut this video short. And we're off to the next call. We had uh, the PD calling us. The officer's gonna go check and see if we missed a call while we were trying to get them unloaded, so hopefully it's not anything of an importance, but I'm assuming they will, they will come back. It looks like, uh, Kobe, you could probably hit that driveway. That probably be the best bet. To turn around, if you can swoop, you've got room. Anyway, yeah, stick around, stay tuned. It is super steep. 
and super dark.